Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Tonight we are going to make spaghetti, Haitian spaghetti with hot dogs and shrimp. Um, my version, of course. Um, we all know how to make Haitian spaghetti one way, but I'm going to show you how I make it my way today. Um, I already seasoned my shrimp with um, Haitian APs and I also use um, Sasson Tropical and Creole seasoning. Um, stay tuned, I'm gonna show you how I make my Asian spaghetti. Mm -hmm. All right, so now we have grapeseed oil. We're gonna start making our spaghetti. Um, just put a little bit, yep, that's good. All right, I think it's hot now. So now we're gonna put Oh, I had the Cover it if you like. I'm gonna wait and see um, how it gets, and then I'll cover it up if I have to. guys we're gonna go ahead and get the cover and cover it up for a little bit all right let's cover it for a little bit and get all that heat all that good stuff into the shrimp so make sure it's cooked perfectly Check it. Thank you. 
add a little bit more egg piece into it. Um, you want to make it, you know, with your flavor. Uh, I'll make another video to show you how I make my egg piece. Why well, usually my husband make my egg piece, but I'll catch him when he's making egg piece. And I'll share it with you guys. Um, when I boil my spaghetti, I always save some of the water to add um, to the sauce instead of um, cold water. So that water is from my um, spaghetti. Alright, it's looking pretty good. So I am going to add uh, ragu. I don't use tomato paste. I use ragu instead. So um, I'm gonna add like a spoon or two to give it color. There we go. All right, we're gonna stir it some more. book I froze my Pima so they stay longer um, my sister taught me that all right guys we're gonna taste it a little bit all right it's getting there so I'm gonna take my um, spaghetti water I'm gonna throw it on the um, DA piece that I season my um, my shrimp in so I'm gonna add a little bit of it. I can stir it because the water is still hot. Um, when I put cold water, I don't like to stir it. Um, I just like to wait it till boil first, and then I stir it. But I can do that because the water is still hot. So I'm gonna add a little bit more water. All right. I'm gonna let it boil a little bit. Um, now I'm gonna add my peppers. Um, if you like a little bit more color, you can of course add some more ragu. Um, um, for me, the color is just fine. I'm um, going to add some timalis. Um, that's the only butter I use. That's the only cooking butter I use. Um, for those of you who use other things, you are more than welcome to add it. But me, I use timalis. So I'm going to add some timalis to my um, sauce. There you go. Okay, that's plenty. A little bit, uh, little bit more of Creole seasoning. It's perfect, and a little bit of my Sasson Tropical. There you go. This thing is gold. Ooh, gonna let it boil a little bit. It's looking good, guys. All right, guys. So now I'm gonna add my spaghetti. I think it's fine. It's boring enough. Um, 
as you can see, I don't add my onions yet. I like to add it a little bit, like almost the same time I put the spaghetti, just so it doesn't cook too much. All right, it's my spaghetti. You can choose any brand. Um, me, I choose Barilla because um, that's the one I had in the house. But usually I use Walmart brand probably. So whatever I can put my hands on, um, this time I used Barilla. All right, so we're gonna mix everything together. It's a lot of spaghetti, guys. I have four boys that's gonna eat that. Um, like I said earlier, for some people it might be a little bit too white, but I don't like using too much. Um, um, color doesn't really matter to me. Um, so for you, you can add more. Um, if you use tomato paste, you can add more to yours. Um, if you notice that it's so long, it's because I haven't cut it. Usually I cut it one boil it, but I'm, I haven't cut it this time. All right. So now I am going to add my onions. I'm gonna stir it some more. that sit for about five to ten minutes to let the water um to let the onion cook a little bit and let the water kind of rise a little bit all right so we're gonna let it you know sit five to ten minutes and then our spaghetti will be all ready You also want some more hot dogs or whatever you use, some answer. Um, you're more than you know, more than welcome to add some, but I think this is plenty for for this one right here. All right, let's let it cook for a little bit, guys. And there you have it, my version of Haitian spaghetti. Um this, thank you guys for watching. This is all I have for you today. Um, if you are new to this channel, please like and subscribe. And don't forget to share it with your friends.